Hey everybody, it is your girl Sylvie Julie, and I'm back today with another video. So, as we seem to have all love, y'all, today is the last installation of graduation pictures so Sunday morning it's not super early it's like eight something something in the morning y'all I literally just woke up like when I said like you know sometimes people say they just woke up but they just they brush their teeth wash their face all this stuff no y'all like I literally just woke up and walked out the room um one of my the my friend that's taking me actually called me and I was just not ready when she called me. Oh. Um but my friend just called me and I'm so happy she called me because I definitely remember turning them alarms off. I don't remember getting up for them at all. So I'm probably finna be a couple minutes late. I won't be too late to where like I'm gonna have to pay extra or whatever, but I'm gonna be a couple minutes on sleep. But that's my fault. Um, so, I'm gonna go here and get my makeup done. I don't know if I said that. But I'm gonna go get my makeup done and then I'm going from there. See y'all. Stop it, Jump on my shoulders. Yes, sir. What? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Turn it off in settings. Oh, you know, the flip thing. This is the, the girls are not done just yet. This is the end of the era for the everybody else in the room. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's the sound? The girls are back in town. Okay. <laughs> hey y'all. Hey y'all. So here is the full official look at the face. Catch the beat. Catch the beat. Mm -hmm. Okay. Catch the lashes. Okay. Got my makeup done by Ambriana in Athens. She's over there on Atlanta Highway. And I picked up a lipstick because I got my I got my makeup done at 10 in the morning. My pictures aren't until 2. So I know I'm gonna eat my mess my lipstick up. So she actually sells um like her lipsticks and all that sort of stuff. So I picked one up to fix throughout the day. I definitely suggest going to her. She did my makeup for my last photo shoot in Athens as well and I loved it. So you know I had to go back it definitely recommended for anybody in Athens who wants to get their makeup done she's perfect and she's super close to campus if you're at UGA but I've been y'all just finished working as an RA turned in my key well not my key for my room but I'm turning my RA key for all the special doors and stuff and stuff and now I slip for my friends because we're gonna try to finish packing they still have a lot of their room left um they still have a lot of their room left and I so so I'm finna pack up my room. I they pack up their room. My folks are on the way for pictures. They're coming to take pictures with me today. Um, but let me show y'all. Our swap this because I was doing my hair last night. Um, that is all my pillows. I gotta put that in there. Those are some clothes I'm gonna throw in one of these suitcases. Both these suitcases are empty. That bag is empty. That bag is trash. Gotta fix that up. Gonna use that bin to put everything in. Just a little sneak peek. That's the dress. I'm gonna put that back in the dryer because there's still a little couple wrinkles in it. Um, here's what my room is looking like. The bed, I spilled something on the bed yesterday. Y'all, I was supposed to vlog with y'all yesterday, but it was just so hectic. Woke up in the morning, spilled stuff on the bed, had to wash it. So I didn't wanna fully put it on because it's gonna come back off today. So, got to do the bed, take everything off. I already disassembled the thing that I had over here. All of that is taped up. This just needs to be packed into a suitcase. That's like my all my leftover snacks. Gotta roll up this. Another bag of trash. This is empty for the most part. Just the clothes that I was supposed to be wearing throughout this weekend. So I need to put that up. TV, I moved over here. Laptop needs to go in the book bag. Shoes from pictures. So, oh, and closet. Empty, just bags on the floor that need to be thrown away. Mirror gotta go. Y'all, even my roommate is that my roommate left yesterday, but she gone. So 
this is this is what the room needs to look like. You see the echo, echo, echo. This is what the room needs to look like. So we're getting there. Um soon. Here's what the bathroom looks like. So yeah, my folks are on the way. I don't know what time they're gonna get here, but the girls wanted to go to Slutty Vegan because we just got a Slutty Vegan Athens location that opened over here. And their first official date is today. And they open at one. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna do it or not because my photo shoot's at two. But I'll see. I may just ask if they can get something for me. I don't know. But some of them are gonna come while I take my pictures. So hopefully they'll be able to get some videos and stuff for y'all. But I'm super excited. Follow me on TikTok at I'm Silly Drew because y'all, I'm trying to I'm trying to do some stuff on TikTok. I'm trying to work on the transitions, all that sort of stuff. So I'm super excited today. I'm gonna be doing a whole lot of that. So it's gonna be a cool day. This is my last day in Athens, y'all. So we're just trying to get out at this point. Let me stop rambling. Let me get to packing, and I'll see y'all later. Yeah. You think so? Yeah, he recorded. All right, strong walk. Get down, pose. Perfect. I mean, I'm tired, but they like, I went tired of this bell. <laughs> Y'all had a few days to do this now. So I'm back home. It is after 11 p.m. I'm officially a UGA alum. I'm also officially out of Athens. Um, Sorry, my makeup looks super red because my lips are on, so like I'm just super red. And I've had makeup on all day, so it's just like different colors and such oxidation. Whatever. But um it's it's done. I'm done with the chapter a journey in my life. And I don't know, it still hasn't like fully settled in just yet. I think it's because I didn't spend four full years. At UJ, the fact that like it still hasn't fully settled in, and unlike other people, I'm not. Um, I think I was good for like accounting or like med school, like something where like there's like a huge job after like a business sort of thing. So that's why I'm kind of just like I'm kind of just vibing right now, sort of thing. But the pictures today were super cool. There wasn't a whole lot of footage. There should be some, but there wasn't a whole lot because. Like I said, my friends are trying to move out because they gotta be moved out by tomorrow. And unlike them, like I have been moving out since like the beginning of the school year. And I've been moving out since the Rider St. Kofa graduation vlog. If you haven't seen that, um, go watch that. But I've been moving out since then. So I've basically moved out over like three days and I've had multiple cars come and help me as well. So I was fully moved out and prepared to like fully move out today. 
since we're all RAs, that most of us, if we're not staying over the summer, we have to be out by tomorrow. And most of them did not start touching their clothes and anything to move out until today. So a lot of them are busy doing that. So I just like, hey, y'all just do y'all stuff. Y'all will see the pictures later. I saw them after. We did like one last little group, little hug. So that was super cool, but I just let them do that. So my dad was um, manning the camera for the vlog today. So there's a little bit of footage, but it's not a whole lot because of course I was also taking pictures with them. They were helping with just make sure everything looked good, all that sort of stuff. So, but if anything, follow me on Instagram at, at I'm Silly Dree so you know when those pictures come out because y'all, I'm super excited. I took, uh, I went, I went off oh, for graduation pictures. I don't take pictures often or at least professional pictures. And if you know me, you know that I love to be in front of a camera. I love to be in front of the mirror. I love taking pictures. I love putting outfits together. I mean, my mind is fashion merchandising. So you already know. Um, so I like, my graduation pictures, if you want me to do a video on like how I planned out my graduation pictures and how I got everything together, how I found um, makeup artists, how I found people to do my hair, how I found um, photographers, because the only thing that I knew was my photographer. Not for this one, but for like one of my other ones. I started to find photographers after. I didn't know who was doing my hair until like the week before. My makeup, same exact way. So if you want a video on how I put all of this together, let me know down in the, in the description box below. Also on how I planned out each individual shoe and how I figured out what to do when. Let me know and I'll definitely do a video for that because I know I'm gonna be helping some of my friends. Like I graduated a year early, so I have a lot of friends that are gonna be graduating next year and the year after that. So I'm already gonna be helping a whole lot of them with their graduation shoots and I'm super excited about it. But if y'all want any help, let me know down below and I'll definitely make a video about that. But stay tuned for those pictures because I'm super excited. I'm super proud of this. And there'll be another vlog. Stay tuned. Make sure you subscribe to the notification bell so you know when another vlog is coming out because I have a lot of stuff planned for this summer. There's a lot of cool things. I'm going to be doing another photo shoot for my birthday. Not just yet because I haven't fully planned that one because I was planning graduation and trying to graduate. But I'm going to be doing another photo shoot for that and I'm super excited for that one so y'all stay tuned so you know when that vlog comes out but i love you all so much i don't want to ramble too too much but make sure you watch if you like this video like it make sure you go back and watch some of the other vlogs that i did i had the graduation vlog where i saw the fireworks i had another graduation vlog and i had two other photo shoots so make sure you all go and watch all of them but i love you all so much let me show y'all let me show y'all hold up hold up hold up hold up this <laughs> is my room from Athens. So this is pretty much everything. There's stuff over there as well. So I don't know if anyone else is like this, but I, since like I started doing Shein and all that sort of stuff, being a college campus ambassador and all that while I was in school, I ended up having a whole lot of Shein stuff that got delivered to school. So I had a full closet basically at school and I still have a full closet here. So I'm gonna be going through all that sort of stuff. If y'all want me to vlog it, let me know. I'm going through all that, throwing things away, donating things, um, things I haven't been, well, not all my clothes have been worn, but things I haven't worn in some time because I also feel like, let me know if y'all feel the same way down below. I'm sorry I'm rambling, but I really want to have a little heart to heart with y'all. But um, let me know, like, have, has anybody felt, especially with, if you're within the same like age range as me, with COVID, it's just, I feel like I'm holding on to clothes so much because I'm like, yeah, you know you do that thing where like you throw away clothes that you haven't worn within like a year or so. But my issue is I feel like, well, with like two, three years knocked off because of COVID, it's kind of like, I feel like it's not that I didn't wear the clothes because I didn't like them, it's because I had nowhere to go. Like I used to go to church all the time and we couldn't go to church because Corona. And now it's like, so can I wear clothes? Like, do I go? Like, I'm not fully back all the way just yet. So it's like, I have all these clothes because I used to always dress up for church. I love dressing up for church. So now it's like I have all these clothes that I would love to wear and I have outfits in my head for them. It's just that I haven't worn them because there's nowhere to go wearing them. So I don't know, y'all let me know. I'm gonna be going through this young adult journey and hopefully I'll be making some videos on just like, how it's like to transition into young adulthood. And because like, you know, like I said, I still have friends within college, you're still gonna be taking coursework. I have to find friends. So learning how to find friends in Atlanta is gonna be something. But um, if I'll be, y'all come along the journey, of course, y'all will be able to see all of this with me. 
but yeah so i have a lot of stuff to do this week gotta get things clean gotta get things in order gotta get my life in order as well but i'm super excited for this next journey thank you all for all of the well wishes and the congratulations i really appreciate it if this has been something that has been done in the long run or not longer but this has been something that has it's just super huge for me like i've been doing dual enrollment in college courses since 10th grade so like i've been doing this for a super long time so i'm super excited to finally be done every summer like my dad always had me in some some in some sort of summer program i did a teacher's program did a robotics program like i did a whole lot of stuff so like it just it's it's kind of surreal to be at a point in life where it's just like oh i don't have to do anything tomorrow i i am because i can't become a couch potato i need to i need to do work that's why i'm getting up on this youtube stuff now but um it's just wild to think that like oh i don't have an assignment to turn in tomorrow our final grades are due tomorrow and that's it like i don't i don't have to receive another grade i don't have to turn in the paper even though like once you get into work you're gonna have to do all that but rambling 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 we can have another talk about adulthood in another video if y'all want me to have a little um we can make a word for it but some sort of talks with y'all but let me go i'm super tired i need to take this makeup off my face remember follow me on tiktok so y'all can see some of the stuff i'm working on the transitions but i'm new to it so hopefully we'll get better as time goes on but super excited my friend graduated yesterday and i'm so excited for her both of us did it in three years so i'm super excited i haven't seen her in so long because of corona and all of that so now being able to be done with this i'll be able to see her again catch up i'm just super excited but i love y'all uga it has been amazing y'all have treated me well there's a lot of work that still needs to be done let me say that especially in terms of like just bringing more multicultural things to campus and also increasing the amount of black or african-american students at uga we need to work on that but i'm super excited thank you all thank you uga and i'm out uga y'all will see me though y'all y'all stay tuned for the vlogs because i will be back where I'll be back, which you know, love you all so, so, so much. Like I said, follow me on Instagram, I'm Silly Jury, and make sure to subscribe to the notification bell so you know when the next video comes out. I love y'all so, so much. We're done with another chapter in our life, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye. But yeah, so I have a lot of stuff to do this week gotta get things clean gotta get things in order gotta get my life in order as well but i'm super excited for this next journey thank you all for all of the well wishes and the congratulations i really appreciate it if this has been something that has been done in the long run or not longer but this has been something that has it's just super huge for me like i've been doing dual enrollment in college courses since 10th grade so like i've been doing this for a super long time so i'm super excited to finally be done every summer like my dad always had me in some some in some sort of summer program i did a teacher's program did a robotics program like i did a whole lot of stuff so like it just it's it's kind of surreal to be at a point in life where it's just like oh i don't have to do anything tomorrow i i am because i can't become a couch potato i need a I need to do work. That's why I'm getting up on this YouTube stuff now. But um, it's just wild to think that like, oh, I don't have an assignment to turn in tomorrow. Our final grades are due tomorrow and that's it. Like I don't, I don't have to receive another grade. I don't have to turn in the paper, even though like once you get into work, you're gonna have to do all that. But rambling, 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 rambling. We can have another talk about adulthood in another video if y'all want me to have a little um we can make a word for it but some sort of talks with y'all but let me go i'm super tired i need to take this makeup off my face remember follow me on tiktok so y'all can see some of the stuff i'm working on the transitions but i'm new to it so hopefully we'll get better as time goes on but I'm super excited my friend graduated yesterday and i'm so excited for her both of us did it in three years so i'm super excited i haven't seen her in so long because of corona and all of that so now being able to be done with this i'll be able to see her again catch up i'm just super excited but i love y'all 
UGA has been amazing. Y'all have treated me well. There's a lot of work that still needs to be done. Let me say that, especially in terms of like just bringing more multicultural things to campus and also increasing the amount of black or African-American students at UGA. We need to work on that, but I'm super excited. Thank you all. Thank you, UGA. And I'm out. UJ, y'all will see me though. Y'all, y'all stay tuned for the vlogs because I will be back. For I'll be back. But you know, love you all so 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 much. Like I said, follow me on Instagram. I'm Silly Jury, and make sure to subscribe to the notification bell so you know when the next video comes out. I love y'all so so much. We're done with another chapter in our life, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.